A4 Media. All rights reserved. What's up, girl? Ain't nothing. This nigga ain't here stressing, talking that old off the wall, back to Africa shit again. What? That guy body shit? Yeah, that dumb shit. I'm trying to get up out of here. I hear that. Yo, singularity of mind. Lime of mind. Mind over matter, right? What's your spirit and mind aligned with? I mean, seriously, man. In your day to day, every day, all day, man. Sit down with a pen and a paper. All right, fold that piece of paper I have. You can fold it in quarters, man. All right, four sections. At the very top of that piece of paper, man. Put mine. Spirit, body, focus. Mind, body, spirit, focus. Right? Now, the objective here is to identify what your mind is on. Daily, weekly, monthly, yearly. What is your mind on? Do the same thing for your spirit. Do the same thing for your body. Do the same thing for your focus. Now determine how much of that supports foreigners. Supports third parties. How much your mind, your spirit, your body, and your focus supports foreigners, man. That's simple, right? Now do this With someone that you consider to be a friend, right? You ask them to do the same thing And then y'all compare Y'all have y'all sit it right in front of both of y'all And you compare You compare the results of What your mind is supporting What your spirit is supporting What your body is supporting And what your focus is supporting because all of this right here ties into the application of your energy. And this analysis here, this comparative analysis, are you seeing that you and this person that you consider to be a friend, are y'all focused on doing anything together? Are y'all... That y'all mentioned that y'all thinking about your friend. Is your spirit aligned or is your spirit relative to your friend's spirit? Is your body, um, the things in which you're engaged in, is it relative to what your friend is engaged in in support of each other or support of everybody else, right? Your focus. Do you and your friends share mutual relative focus? This is just an exercise. This is a demonstration. So let me tell you something. I don't got too many people I can do this with for one. But I consider a friend. <laughs> Quote unquote friends are unfriendly, man. I feel like this, man. Yo, friend is what the fuck has always been, right? Since she was a kid. You can see him on the playground. Have fun with him. Got to push each, push each other on the swings. <coughs> you know, spin the merry-go-round together. And jump on it and spin around, you know, go down a sliding board together, 
going to monkey balls together. You got to do all these things together. Your mind is focused. Your spirit is focused. Your body is focused on what y'all doing. This ties into something I call the playground theory. Now I understand, you know, people, they consider themselves to be adults and all of that. But what about these other people? Are they not adults where they invest in things together? They put their minds into what they're doing together. They organize themselves together where their spirit is all present. And all of their energy is focused on what they are doing together. Playground theory. Yo, if, if 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 we cannot maintain alignment of our mind, our spirit, our body, our actions, our focus, our value and appreciation for each other, if we can't do that, then exactly what can we do together? We can do what we've seen being done. What's happening right now? Supporting everybody else. After all, your mind is on everybody else. Your spirit is aligned with everybody else's or being given to these other by all these other people. Your bodies, your active, your actions are associated with everybody else. Your focus is on everybody else. Therefore, your energy. It goes everybody else, except for you and yours. Cow season is over. A4 Media.